We now have six brand new contestants. Let's meet them. For 22 years, plenty have tried, but only five contestants have won. Who wants to be a millionaire's jackpot prize? Now a sixth will join them. No details have been released about the winner, but the executive producer says it was an electric moment. I'm a nervous wreck. I'm usually on pacing backwards and forwards, and because we have to social distance, I couldn't even do that. So I was just... Um, yeah, just living every moment, I think, is, is, is the truth with that particular player. Because you can't help but be caught up with the, with the journey. And the drama was played out against a changed setup because of COVID. There will be no audience, which gave us a bit of a problem with the Ask the Audience lifeline. Naturally, I suggested a second Ask the Host option, but the producers said that would be unwise, despite my vast knowledge of the Volkswagen Scirocco Mark I and Mark II. You've just won one million! Judith Keppel was the first to win a million on the show back in 2000. Major Charles Ingram won the grand prize, but it was never paid out after he was accused of cheating in an infamous coughing scam. Have you got a strategy? Um, well, I have, actually. I have. The story was turned into an ITV drama quiz. Why did you change your mind so often? That's what the producers want. It's the, the, um, the, 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 the drama, the tension. Exactly. Ingram was convicted, but has always denied any wrongdoing. It's such a big deal for someone to scoop the million. The clues in the title, of course, it's life-changing money to win 500 grand, but everyone wants to see someone get the million. And so I think the rating's going to go through the roof. In the COVID world we live in, Jeremy Clarkson may have to wait some time before he can hug the next millionaire winner. Neil Connery, News at 10.